The Rotary Club of Portland was established in 1915. Their goal is to encourage and foster the ideal of service to promote peace and understanding throughout the world. Leslie McBain talked with Jack Carr, the president of the Portland Rotary, about the many ways they contribute to our community. Jack, uh, Rotary Club of Portland has been around for quite a number of years, and I think a lot of people don't really understand what it's all about. Could you enlighten us? <laughs> Well, that's actually exactly why I'm here. Um, you ask the average per person on the street what a Rotarian is, and they'll probably describe a retired old guy with a tie on, like, you know, <laughs> like me. Uh, but re in reality, it's a wide range of people that meet almost all the demographic nuances across the community. Um, we've been around for a long time. The Rotary Club is probably one of the largest organizations in the world that does services. We have 34,000 clubs across the country. We're in virtually every, we're in more countries, frankly, than the United Nations. Yeah. We have more power in terms of influence on those countries than many um, government leaders as well as the United Nations. Uh, we have over 1.2 million people, yet nobody knows who we are. <laughs> they mistake us with people to wear funny hats and, and <laughs> wear dress up in clothes, different clothes. Yeah. But Rotarians are, if you go to a local meeting, they look like just like the people walking on Congress Street. They have short mm -hmm. sleeves, they don't have ties, sometimes they do, but they're a cross of the entire demographics of the city. Um, and what, what primarily is your function? What do you do as a club here in Portland, in the Portland area? We are a, a service organization. Mm -hmm. What a service organization means is that we're looking for things that need to be done in the community that would help not only the local community, but internationally sometimes. In the local community, um, we provide a lot of uh, donations of to terms of both money, but also volunteers. Volunteers is extremely important for Rotarians to get out in the streets, meet people, um, and get involved with the community. Uh, this year, as president, my theme was youth mm -hmm. and endangered youth mm -hmm. in the community. And so we focused on uh, p in youth at risk. So we've spent a lot of time mentoring at the Long Creek Institution. Oh, uh, we do a lot of mentoring at, at the schools. I'm involved very heavily with the Portland High School in mentoring and mentoring in various types of programs and I and I have a mentee that I, that I meet with every week and help him with his homework and do whatever I want. We've been, I've been doing that for years but many other Rotarians are doing the same thing. And um, it's so crucial to a healthy community to have well-mentored kids, especially you know, no matter the, what, the, where their background. Especially with the change of demographics. Mm -hmm. I mean, three years ago, I was working with a young kid that survived the genocide in Congo and got him a full scholarship to Colby. And now we are working. I'm working with a, a young man in, in Portland High School from Afghanistan and survived all that, and he's back here with his family. So there's different kinds of people that need help yeah. out there. So we do that. Scholarships are important. Uh -huh. Within the last month, we've given scholarships to every major high school in the area. Oh, my goodness. Um, we've given money also to the PATHS program for, we call it a tool ship, mm -hmm. where we could actually give money that they can buy tools to go out in the world and work either in the vocational schools mm -hmm. or on a job and get a job. Yeah. So education for our youth is very important, keeping kids at risk. But we also support the community in different ways. When the canine dog died recently, the Portland Police mm -hmm. Department, just last month, we bought a new dog for them. It's uh, called Roto, by the way. Roto. For Rotarian. You know. so anyway, I like that. So you can say hi to Roto when you see him <laughs> walking down the street. Um, so we do a lot of things. We, we, we give money uh, to folks uh, all over the community. The Salvation Army, their recent daycare program mm -hmm. they opened up, we funded that. Now, do you search for these uh, 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 people or organizations in need, or do people come to you and say, look, I have just found out about this this group and they're struggling, uh, can Rotary help them? Well, absolutely, it comes in different ways. Uh -huh. uh, sometimes we'll know it because you know we have some 120, 130 some odd Rotarians and they're involved in the community and they hear things, so they bring it to our attention in one way or the other. Sometimes we have a theme, like I mentioned, youth at risk, and we go out and look for it. Mm -hmm. We call the local schools, the guidance offices, and find out what they need. Rather than telling them what we're going to do for them, ask mm -hmm. them what they need. And we get surprising answers. We talk to the local medical people. When, when Haiti had their problems and uh, Conte Sante needed support with the, after the earthquake, you know, we loaded up containers of medical goods uh. and shipped it out. And we do that in a variety of other It sounds like countries. you're covering a wide range. And we're going to have to wrap it in a minute. But I know you do work internationally through Rotary, um, eradicating polio, trying to. Well, internationally, some of our biggest programs um, are involved with polio. Mm -hmm. We're, we are the, 
the major leader in the world eradicating polio. And we're this close. We'll probably have it done in a very short period of time. And we'll get you back and maybe talk more about that because it's there's too much to talk about in this Certainly short is. segment. If people want to get in in touch, find out more about it. How the can best way to do it is you? check out our website. Just go Rotary um, uh, Portland Rotary. Go to dot com. Or you can email us at portlandrotary at mm -hmm. main.rr.com. And we'll be happy to talk to you. We want everybody that can yeah. come to one of our meetings to come. It's and there are great speakers. So Right. We're at the Holiday Inn by the Bay. It's a nice place to come. Thank you, Jack. This Appreciate was great. It. Appreciate <laughs> it very much. Thank you. Yeah.